No. Uh-uh. I am as big. And before I get all you crazy Tupac fans that come in and hit the dislike button, I am the biggest Tupac fan there is. You guys are all eyes on me and Machiavelli fans, Death Row Pac fans. So I already know. Listen, I was Tupac way before you guys is even thought of. Now, with that being assessed, Tupac Shakur should not be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame before LL Cool J. Now, here's the thing that gets me. You have to be... 25 years after your first album release to be eligible for the Hall of Fame. When Tupac first album came out, which was Apocalypse Now, that was in 1991. LL Cool J already had four albums out. Mama Said Knock You Out was already out. So you looking at radio, Bad, Walking with a Panther, and Mama Said Knock You Out, all before Tupac's album even came out. Apocalypse Now just came out. So soon as he's become eligible, he goes over LL Cool J? LL is not even in rock and roll. Mama Said Knock You Out alone. Is a rock song. I don't even know if Tupac even performed with a rock band. And he goes before LL Cool J? That's insanity. And over all the years, period, his catalog alone should be in the hall. If it wasn't for LL Cool J... Rap would not have gotten to the platform it is right now. He revolutionized a MC from the streets. Now, he wasn't somebody that was commercial. He came from the streets, battling dudes and whatever. He was the number one rap star in the world. There was Run DMC, and then there was LL Cool J. There will be no Russell Simmons in Def Jam if it wasn't for LL Cool J. He was the first artist to do something on Def Jam. The first guy to create a love song. All these guys making love records, all these R&B records y'all coming out with, none of this would have happened if it wasn't for I Need Love. None of it. And he's not in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame? It's criminal. I'm not saying Pac don't belong in the rock, the rock and Roll Hall of Fame. But not before LL go in, no. The Dale Phonics ain't even in there. Or the Stylistics. And they should have been in. The biggest record of all time, Rock and Roll record, is by Chubby Checker, The Twist. Come on, baby, let's do the twist. That's not even, he ain't even in the hall. So there's a lot of people that should be in there before Tupac Shakur. And I'm the biggest Tupac fan there is, but I know right is right. And there's no way Tupac Shakur should be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame as soon as he's eligible. No. Uh-uh. I'm not buying it. This is a political move. And this is exactly what Pac talked about. They're doing this because of that movie. They're doing this because they want to create more of an engine to make move money off of Tupac's movie. And he said this. Pac said when he go... Everybody who hated him is going to talk about how great he was and, oh my God, I've interviewed Pac. And he said he knew this was going to happen. He said his mom told him. Remember? He said they did the same thing to Malcolm X. He says everybody hated him, but as soon as he died, everybody want to write a book and talk about how they interviewed him. 
And Pac said what? I just don't like that. If you don't like me, don't write about me. Don't talk about me. Talk about something else. You doing something I can't do, I'm doing something you can't do. Why can't it just be like that? Now, I'm not saying he shouldn't be in there, but there's a lot of people that should be in there. Heck, NWA just went in. And they use songs and samples from the stylistics in the Dale Phonics. And they in there. <laughs> Nobody plays a musical instrument at all, but they're in the Hall of Fame. But the stylistics in the Delphonics or Chubby Checker, none of those guys are in there. LL Cool J, he ain't in there. It's politics, baby. So when I see Tupac Shakur going into the to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, I have reservations about that because there's no way he should be in it right now. And if he's going to go in right now, he should have been going in with LL Cool J, the Delphonics, Stylistics, all of those guys should have went in. If not, then what is the hall? It's tainted. So hopefully you guys were smart enough to listen to the video before you made your opinion and start hitting a dislike button. But the majority of you will only read the title and hit dislike because you're stupid. It's your boy Carcino. I'm out.